What's good, everybody? It is your girl, Joanne Gray, and I'm back today with another wig review. It's long overdue. I have a wig from Vanessa Wig Company. Her name is Dina, or Dinah. It's probably Dinah, D-I-N-A. And she is in the color SP427. And it's a slightly old-fashioned looking wig. It's got these little flippy curly things in the back. It's got these straight bangs in the front. Alrighty, so I'm going to put the wig on and my mirror is over to this side. I'm going to adjust the tabs only to the first hook far away from that tag because when you put your wig that close to the tag, it can cause a ripple in your wig and cause your wig to be quite lumpy and have a lift in the back. So be very careful about that. And when you're putting on your wigs, of course, make sure that you line up your ear tabs with your ears. Run your fingers along the perimeter of the wig. In the back, you can use your thumbs. In the front, use your index finger and just go along the band of the wig. And um, pull all the hairs out that need to be out. Now, this is the wig just plopped right on my head. Um, ooh. Okay. <laughs> Okay, the way it is on my hair right now, it would appear that the hair just kind of favors going over parted to the right. You've got a shorter part on the right side of the wig and the longer bang on the left side of the wig. you got these tight curls all the way around. And I think what we're going to do is just brush those out and see what's what. So again, if you don't watch my videos all the way through, you may dislike this wig just from me putting it on my head. Trust me when I tell you that wigs require styling. Your love's got me saying, ooh, ooh, back in the days like it used to. Let's get together and ooh, ooh, give me all the things that I'm used to. Your love's got me saying, ooh, ooh, back in the days like it used to. Let's get together and ooh, ooh. Big dibs on the track, Joe Tree. So, what I'm seeing that I'm going to do is give the wig a little more play over to my left side. So, what I'm doing is just kind of tilting the wig just a tad and putting the left side tab closer down to where my ears are. I'm going to frame my bangs over towards the left as well. And then this side of the wig just kind of frame my face with. So I'm thinking this is a cute little hairdo, a cute little unique little hairdo. Again, her name is Dinah. And I'm thinking this is how I'm going to wear her. Try it anyway. Okay. So you all let me know what you think. Again, this is the Dina wig or the Dina wig. The Dina wig and an SP427. I bought it from my local beauty supply store. I will look for it for you online. Again, check the information box below for everything that you need. The eyeshadow look today is from Lorac. I used... Um, the Lorac Love and Money palette. I hope you enjoy this look. Thank you for your time and your energy. And I will be back later with another wig review and anything else I could dream up. You have an awesome day. God bless. Joe Tree, Joe.